Hello everybody, this is Lauren of Plan Mosh Plan. Welcome back to another planner video. <laughs> Normally I say plan with me, but this is a, a haul video. Um, I mentioned this in my last video. I used to do all of my kind of like sticker hauls on Instagram, but uh, the one that I just put up, even though it was really long, I'm gonna try and make this one shorter, got a good response and no one was like, ah, I miss you doing this on Instagram, so I thought I'd keep on going with it. Um, the shops that I'm going to talk about in the first part of this video, I'm sure there'll be more parts to this, but, uh, what I have in front of me today is Panabra Design, Planning World, and Designing San Diego, so I'm going to start there, um, and then, oh, I think I have a Giving Girl order, too, which I have to find, <laughs> I'm going to start there, um, so if you are interested, keep on watching. Alright, I did have an order from the Giving Girl, if... <laughs> you've been following along you may know that I let my mall or my mail sit in my hallway for um, a little bit before I open it because of everything that's going on so I kind of lose track okay here we go um, it comes in a really pretty package like that and then there is this freebie sort of like a washi card I think those are called and then these are um, just dots I don't know if you can tell with some foiled bows on some of them um, as the freebie. And then here is the order. Okay, so this is what I ordered, this uh, bow box sampler. And then this was included in my order. I'm not sure if it's included in everybody's order um, or if this was a gift. If so, thank you, Jennifer. Um, it's really pretty. These are transparent, um, kind of dots with arrows or bows so they're not they're yeah they're transparent stickers they're not really like opaque they're really pretty they're in rose gold foil I have seen um a lot of like transparent sticker trends I feel like it's a kind of a more functional thing but these are I don't know in person these are really pretty so I'm really excited to get a chance to use those um but what I placed the order for was she came out with these um, bow strung box samplers. If you followed me for all again, you know I love the bow strung boxes. I have been a really big proponent of them um, and kind of talk about them a lot in all of my plan with me's. And she came out with this sampler of um, where you could buy like the there's a few different colors and you could buy the whole kind of uh, group. I think of them where you buy like all of the colors and all of the foils and I think that the, that is what I ended up doing I have to check my invoice I may have done it individually because you could also purchase them individually too so these are the ones that I normally use in the spread but I was really interested in trying out these kind of horizontal ones too I really really like those the hearts are ones that I probably wouldn't have gone for um, by myself you know like I probably wouldn't have purchased just a sheet of hearts like this but um, I like that they're on there. I think that for like a date night or something like that, it's cute too. I probably just won't get as much use of, out of them as like this, these kind of more classic looking ones. So I purchased them again in all three foil colors. Um, this is the powder pink version of the sampler. This is silver, rose gold, and gold. This is the cream colorway of the sampler, which is really more of a very light kind of powdery uh i'd call it a warm toned pink but very slightly and i think this is probably the one that i'll get the most use out of this color is super neutral it's a super neutral pink that i feel like you could pull into most spreads um and it that color will go with most spreads this is the um mauve Oh, here we go okay these are actually two different colors this is mauve chiffon looks like i bought this individually i must have not bought the whole set because i just got it in gold and then this color is the almost mauve which it looks like i om only bought in rose gold and gold i'm regretting that this would actually look really nice in silver and i feel like this color is probably one that would go with a lot of silver kits like kits that I would buy that are already silver foiled this color would go with it this is a really nice neutral kind of mauvey purple that I think I would use I'll, I have a lot of kits that use this color and then um, this is the sea salt color which again is a really pretty kind of neutral dusty blue 
Um, again, I like this color a lot and I think I will use this color a lot. I got it in silver and gold. Um, uh, like my immediate reaction is I'm regretting picking up, not picking up the rose gold, but in reality, most kids that have this color blue that I would pick up are probably silver or gold foiled anyway, so that's probably fine. Um, okay, so that's pretty much it. That was all that I, I picked up in this order. I do think I have another one coming if I'm not wrong soon, but um, yeah, I just really, I really like using these Bostron boxes, and I like that she uh, made them a single kind of colorway like this, because previously they weren't available like that. They were, I think, only available um, like this, where it has a bunch of different colors. Obviously, this one's very used here. Here's a not used one. <laughs> I like this version too, but was really excited to have this kind of sampler. So um, yeah, can't wait to start using these. Okay, next up is Planning World, and I am so excited about this order in particular. Um, I do PR for planning world for you on my coupon code is down below it's lauren15 um i always like to just mention that but um this order is so exciting to me because it's a reformat of her kits which i i have always liked the format of her kits i always feel like whenever she comes out with a new format of her kits it gets better and better which i do not feel the same way about that for all shops i'll say that for sure um but this one is super exciting to me because this reformat was just literally so good so uh before i get into the format i also want to show you this is the freebie um i don't know if that's a sticker or if it's just like a little cutout and then i also just picked up some of her laptops these are her $2 Tuesdays. She has a bunch of $2 Tuesdays that are just kind of this really pretty style and um, they're foiled like this. Just really pretty and really kind of classically drawn icons. So if you're interested in that, definitely take a look. But I really am excited to talk about the kit format for sure. So I just feel like, oh, like, oh my goodness, was she listening <laughs> to what people are saying um, they want. So um, this kit is called here, I'll get this out of the way. B205. Her kits are um, named or numbered, sorry, rather than named. This is uh, a gold foil, probably a light gold foil. This is the B6 version of the kit, which I like to pick up too, just because it has like extra headers and a lot of extra boxes and extra deco, which I always need more of. So I always like to pick up that too. And even this ver like this reformat is so good of the B6 version. Like these, she added a bunch of quarter boxes in and she foiled a lot of the like, um, sorry, these are third boxes, which I've been wanting more of. And then she foiled a lot of the um, boxes here. And I just love that. I just really like the foiling that she did. I, it, not all foiling on boxes is created equal. They're also simpler. There's like less of the kind of deco in the corners and more of the foil accents, which I just really like. And I just think that they're really really pretty plus like the date covers that she includes they're always stuff that you can pull into other spreads like they just she doesn't make them too like specific to the kit which i really appreciate so that's the b6 version which is awesome and then she also redid her bow sampler page and made this more functional i think before there was um or bow header page sorry there was flags up here which is great but like i, I Think it's such a trend right now to have the scallops instead and i really appreciate that she added them in and then i've been saying i just love the like single bow um headers instead of the bow like all the way across bow headers i've been really into that and then just the extra like scallop detail and the extra foiling on the sides i just think this is so pretty and i'm like excited when i see this sheet it's like new and fun and exciting rather than just kind of like a regular bow header sheet i just think it's really really cool um, okay, and then on to like the meat and potatoes of this. This is the kit. So she actually has flipped her kit from being horizontal to being vertical now, which I've heard shops say it means you can fit a lot more stickers on the pages. I don't know. I'm not quite a geometry person where I understand how that works, but <laughs> I've heard it been said before. Um, so this is the artwork for this kit. Um, besides the fact that it's a really great kit reformat, I just, it's like very... Now I feel I'm planning on using this for a Mother's Day memory plan just because I feel like the cake baking is kind of Mother's Day-y but it's just very like home, work, planner, coffee kind of vibes which is 
what we're doing right now and then you still get this page that has the whited out boxes um too i never use that that much but i'm not mad that it's there and then this page as well like makes my heart so happy oh my goodness okay so we've got three foiled um third boxes again i love and then i just love these these quarter boxes here they're so pretty truly just the foil like the scallop foiling and then the foiling here it's just it's like besides the fact that it's literally perfectly foiled i do not see a single mistake on the foiling um there's no dots no no scratches no nothing um it's just there's so many quarter boxes like one two three four five there's 15 quarter boxes that's incredible you can use two quarter boxes a day just from this sheet and then the third boxes are so good and then the headers here i like that they're like different colors with different um you know hearts bows and star like hearts and bows i just i just think it's really cool like it's different no one else is doing that and it's cute and i like it and like it's it's not different trying to be different it's just a good different and then we've got a whole nother page of half boxes it's so good <laughs> it's really so good these are more than half of them are foiled um and then you've got obviously some some um hexagons and, and circles up there as well as build dues and habit trackers but really i'm just excited about like the foiling on this it just looks so good um okay on to this page you've got washi and now there's three strips of washi all foiled really pretty i really like these flags really pretty i like that they are short they don't take up the full width of the um column which is something i talk about all the time her date covers as always are gorgeous i don't even know what these are but i think they're really pretty and you can just like i don't know put them on like uh like just in the corner of something i don't know i just they're pretty they're really pretty <laughs> or turn them like sideways and then this too i love small little stickers like this you can use to mark meetings or to do's or whatever they're just it's just really good and then here's the last page it has deco which i appreciate i love using deco in kits it's just really pretty something i like to call it about her kits too is that they always include multiple skin tones you do not have to pay extra for that and the boxes are foiled um and i just feel like that deserves a shout out because that is not true for all shops she always has multiple skin tones in her kits and they come included and foiled um this deco is super cute I think if you like the kind of old, the stuff is more a little bit more old school to me, flags, circle icons, and um, checklists. But if you like that kind of stuff, it's all here and it's all foiled too. I do like her checklists. As far as checklists go, I don't really use them. But if I were to, I like the style of these, which again is not true for me for all kits. So I am just super excited about this reformat. I think it is so good. Good job, Yuan. I know I've said it to you a million times in your DMs, but... <laughs> just really excited about it i think it's really good and i love this kit i cannot wait to use it um and yeah that's pretty much all i have to say about it again i do have a coupon code for her i do do pr for her but this is truly all my opinion um like i'm i can't act being this stoked i just genuinely am this stoked so um but if you do if you are interested my pr code is lauren 15. All right, next up is Designing San Diego. This is a new to me shop and I kind of just really purchased all one of the, <laughs> one of the same thing. Um, this is her business card and then this is the foiled freebie um, with some cute and very um, poignant <laughs> uh, scripts on here. I'll definitely get use out of those. So that is super cute. Um, I do want to say that I found this stuff via Allie Jones plans, Allie of Allie Jones plans. I am obsessed with her videos right now. I kind of just rediscovered them and I'm bitching them like crazy. And I'm just obsessed with everything that she's doing and every, like just everything about her videos. I'm super obsessed with right now. So you're definitely going to hear me over my next few plan with me's be like, talk about Allie and that I'm emulating Allie and that I am just like honestly totally ripping stuff that she does because I think it's so good and she's so talented so if you haven't checked her out definitely go and do that she truly has a beautiful and dainty and unique planner style that is just so good and she uses these stickers so I picked them up um this sheet I actually just picked up 
to try out. I don't think I saw her use these, but I just wanted to try it out. And they're like appointment stickers and they have doctor, dentist, hair, nail, and oh, just scheduling an appointment scripts. They're, and like truth be told, they're a little bit small for me. They are like not even half the width of the column, which I think for me is probably too small for what I need it for, but they are um, pretty cute. I'm glad I just got them in one foil because I don't think I'll get too much use out of them. But again, they're $2, so like whatever also at the same time. Um, these are the stickers that Allie uses that I just love and she places them um, like I was just talking about all of these bowstrung boxes. A lot of times she places them in a bowstrung box and they fit kind of perfectly. I don't know if you can tell, probably not, but they fit perfectly in the box. So um, that's really cute. And they're just the, um, like youtuber scripts plan film edit and upload video so i got two of them in each color and i just think they're really really pretty like they're just they're well foiled they're transparent and i really like the script i've mentioned before i'm super picky about scripts and i just really like this one so um silver is always looks the same to me this is a super pinky rose gold um definitely no copper to it at all it's like pink very rosy and then this gold is a very yellow um, gold too. So I like to mention that because I like to know before I purchase from a shop what kind of foil, rose gold and gold foil they have. But yeah, um, I am super excited to have these. And for first impressions, the foil looks really good and I'm excited about them. Next up is Panda Bird Design. I placed three orders with her like during her sale time. <laughs> and this is the last of them. Um, this came with two kind of cardstock pieces like that and she wrote a really sweet note. Thank you Jess, I appreciate it. And then I got um, Amanda's freebie as well as this kind of foiled freebie both in gold foil which I appreciate very much. They're light gold which is probably what I use the most. I love Amanda's freebie. Um, my life stuck on paper if you don't know who Amanda is and then she also sent um, me the, these houses which I already had to steal one off of which are super cute and very poignant for um, you know just staying at home right now so thank you Jess I really appreciate that and then um, really why I, I'm gonna clear all this stuff but really why I placed this order was for her scripts. I already have a couple of her scripts and I have a lot of, like in my previous orders, I placed a lot of um, orders for script samplers and I just wanted more scripts to go along with that. So um, these are all the scripts here and then I did just kind of pick up two additional things. More of these pink and gold scallops just because I run through them so quickly, especially when I'm marking like using them to marking mark work from home every day of a week five days a week I just go through them really fast so I just got some more of those and then I have been really liking I've been getting a lot of inspiration from other planners like um Tay of Shante plans for using just more like flourishes I've always used the rose color days ones and kind of left it at that but I'm kind of opening my eyes to more flourishes and I'm liking these ones that don't take up the full width of the column a lot so i picked them up in transparent and light gold foil and i think that i'm going to get more um in addition to these because i'm really liking it and then um these are the scripts that i got like i said i already have a lot of them and i just kind of wanted to round that out a little bit i messaged her and asked her for some work from home ones and i love how these turned out these wfh ones are so pretty and they're just the perfect size like that's really the perfect size for me i'm super excited about it thank you so much jess for making these these are exactly what i wanted <laughs> and i'm really really stoked on it and then she also um oh and then i just got them in um rose gold light gold and silver everything that's what i got all the scripts in not gold just because i prefer light gold so much over regular gold i also got the work well i also asked her to make ones that said work from home instead of just wfh and she messaged me and she was like what do you think if they're like vertical or horizontal instead of more like uh let me find like the day off ones or whatever you know that have their they're not they're like layered with some some um uh print um, and I was like, yeah, go for it. Like I like anything. Um, and I think these are cute too. I, they don't quite take up the full, uh, they take up just about the full width of the box. 
Um, I think that they're going, I think I'll get more use out of the WFH ones just for the size because I do like to tend to layer them over things, but there are a couple of, like I do have some ideas for how I could make these work too that I think will be really cute too. They're a little bit small, I'll say that. I didn't quite expect that, I guess, but um, I do I do like them. I think a, like it'd be cute too to do the work in a print and then the from home in the scripty font underneath, but these are really nice and uh, you know, we'll have every opportunity in the world to use all different types of all different types of work from home scripts over the next couple of months. And then I think I mentioned this in the last haul. I also was looking for Zoom scripts. I think she already had these in her shop. And yeah, we just, I need a lot of them. So this is really pretty. Again, her curse of these look much better than anything I could ever do. Um, so yeah, Zoom. We all know about Zoom by now. Um, and then these are just some ones that I either already have and need more of or had on the samplers or whatever. Just stuff that I need. Payday scripts. Pretty self-explanatory. Date night scripts. Pretty self-explanatory. Although who knows when we can go out on date nights again. Our date nights now are kind of just looking like cooking together and making drinks together at home, which is nice too, but you know. And then these are day off scripts. So um, I already have, yeah, I was gonna say the only thing that I really think I'm missing is laundry scripts, but I actually already have laundry day scripts from her. So, um, okay, that is everything that I have from Panda Bird Design. Hello, okay, I'm back for either the second or third part of this haul, not quite sure, don't quite remember. And I'm not sure if it's going to be the last yet either. I have four sticker shops to share with you. Um, this is Sweet Belle XO, Hello Petite Paper, Planning Like a Pro, and Honey Inked. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm not sure if this is gonna be the last part or not. I'm trying to find a good balance of um, how long hauls should be, so, um, and I don't do them very often, but I kind of want to. I have a lot more coming in still. So um, if you're watching this, I would really appreciate if you go comment down below like what your perfect haul would look like would be really, <laughs> would be really great. Like whether that's, oh, I like 30 minute hauls, I like hour long hauls, or I like hauls that have a bunch of like 10 different sticker shops, or I like hauls that have a bunch of icons or a bunch of foil or a bunch of kits or a mixture of both would love um would love to see that just so i can kind of get an idea of what you guys are interested in but okay all that said i'm going to jump into this round of the stickers first up is hello petite paper um these are the this is the freebie and then this is a journaling card or whatever i don't know what people call these <laughs> i think i would after all this time and her business card which is actually really pretty um i got two foiled kits and an add-on kind of like Oh, that goes over there. Mini kit. I do want to be totally transparent and say it is now midway through June and I placed this order at the beginning of April and it got super stuck. And um, I know it wasn't Vanessa's fault. She shipped it like two weeks later, but it took about two months after it shipped to get to me. So I think she's resolved. And I, I know a lot of people were having the same issue. Like they, she, uh, she sent a batch of orders to the post office and I, I don't know if they got stuck in customs or what this has happened to me before though with international shops sometimes like it's just a risk you run when you shop internationally so um and I know it was like I think in part with the pandemic and all of that so I think that she feels confident that she's resolved or the shipping issues have been resolved and like I've mentioned in past hauls you know COVID all that stuff totally out of their control I'm happy to wait but um, yeah, I will just I just wanted to put it out there in case you're like, oh, I want that kit now <laughs> Like maybe don't buy it if you need it for like, you know next month or something. So anyways, okay I'm going to show you the two different kits that I got. All right This is the first kit that I purchased. It's called sunny days um, It's a foiled kit. Both of the kits that I purchased are foiled. They're definitely kind of few and far between for Hello Petite Paper. So um, when you see that she offers a foiled kit, I would recommend picking it up because a lot of times she like will offer the kit for, uh, you know, a long amount of time, but she won't offer it foiled forever. So um, it 
came with this foil sampler sheet that's super cute these bows are like very her style something i really like about her and you'll hear me say about a lot of shops is she does all of her own artwork and i just have a soft spot in my heart for shops that do all their own artwork so i really like this foil sampler it's very like useful for my kind of style of planning and then here are the full boxes i have i mentioned earlier I was looking um, for more kind of pastel summery kits. There was a lot of dark summery kits this year and there's always a lot of bright ones, but I really like the pastels. I like that this has like, of course the pastel pink, blue, peach, purple, like that's always gonna be my kind of vibe. And then, um, yeah, it's just got her like classic kind of signature florals as well as some really cute, um, deco that comes along with it. I always love her boxes. I, I just really like the design on those. Um, oh, that weekend banner is super cute too. I might have to use that. But yeah, so that is kind of the, the kit as it comes. Um, so you get like two and a half pages foiled, I'd say. Um, and the foiling on the boxes is really cute. And then I also picked up the deco sheet just because I love her deco. Um, and a lot of the stuff I will end up using functionally, I think, but I picked that up separately. And then I also kind of splurged. I do this every once in a while and I picked up her, like the mini kit version. So it has all of the full boxes. They're not foiled. I will give these away. Um, and then it just has more half boxes and quarter boxes, which I really like. And then these build -dos, you can very easily take an icon and put it over top and just get kind of like a more icon label or quarter box kind of look and then something that she does in the mini kits she adds these icons these like really detailed icons that match the rest of the kit she doesn't have those in her full kit i wish she would because i love them and sometimes i find myself being tempted to buy the mini kits just to get the icons because <laughs> they're so cute and they match so well so that is um everything that i bought for sunny days and i'm really excited to use that for summer and then the next kit that I bought, um, I had intended to use for spring. Obviously spring has passed. It's called um, Grateful Heart. I do think it's kind of an anytime kit though, so I'm not too worried about it like being out of season or anything like that. So again, it's the exact same format. Really cute, um, really cute kind of foil sampler sheet. I like that there's like but there, there's two sets of foiled headers. That's how many headers I use when I plan personally. Um, so I like that. And I like that these are like a neutral and you could pull into any spread that you wanted if you wanted to leave them. And then there's pattern headers that are still foiled with the bows. That's really cute. Um, these are the full boxes. Both of these are gold foil. I'd say that they're a very true gold. They're certainly not light gold, but it's not like crazy yellow gold either. Just super soft and pretty like it's such a pretty kit her florals are just gorgeous it's like a bunch of ranunculus i feel like and that's my favorite flower so pretty i love this i love that she still offers washi i feel like shops don't offer washi in their kits anymore if you've seen me lately i've been like on a rampage about kit formats <laughs> and washi is something i feel like i haven't talked about but i still really like when um shops offer um washi in their kit how cute is that bow so cute i love these colors i feel like if i had like a little girl who was very girly i would love to like have these colors for a bedroom for a little girl i don't know why she just had a baby a little girl i think congrats vanessa if you're watching so sweet all right sorry if i'm not going through this fast enough since we already did it anyways okay so that is everything i got from hello petite paper i actually have another order coming from her soon um so maybe more in this haul i'm not quite sure yet but that's everything <laughs> you know what i lied i totally forgot i have deco that i bought that goes along with this kit too just super sweet pretty florals i really like that planner so definitely we'll use that in the spread Okay, next up I have an icon order from, sorry if you hear my phone vibrating, <laughs> from Planning Like a Pro. Um, I saw these icons and I got really excited about them because they're like a very neutral pink. I love when icons are this color pink because this is a color that will match literally every spread that I'm doing. Um, so, um, 
Also, Shani sent me some extra. She put a note. So thank you so much, Shani. I really appreciate that. Whatever she sent me, she did a good job because I can't tell right away what I ordered and what she sent me, which means that she knows what I like because <laughs> I can't remember. And they all look like stuff I would like. I think these date night stickers maybe. Um, these are super cute. I really like those in the silver foil. Um, yeah, I do have a coupon code for Shini down below too, Planning Like a Pro. I think it's Lauren15, but definitely um, check out down below. Okay, sorry, I'm out of frame. This is a sampler. I love this sampler. I love samplers like this. This is so usable, and I will definitely put this in my sticker book that I keep handy always because these are all super usable stickers. You can pull into any spread. I love that. I don't know if I ordered these pillows or not. I think I must have. These are adorable. This would be super cute with a sleep-in script. I need more sleep-in scripts. I never um, think to order them or get them as a customs. Like whenever I see custom scripts that I like, I always, um, these are super cute wine glasses. I really like my doodly wine glasses. Look, this is literally sitting right in front of me. <laughs> I love doodly wine glasses and I really like that pink color. Anyways, whenever I'm planning, I always think about how I need custom scripts that say sleep in. And then whenever I order custom scripts, I never remember that when I'm ordering, so I don't have any. Um, anyways, I'm just showing you, flipping through all of the icons that she had. I, obviously, I bought a lot of them. I do like to kind of match icons and use similar types of icons in spread. So, like, if I use one of these, I'll pull them into a bunch of different spreads. Or I'll pull a bunch of the same icons from the same shop into my spreads or ones that look similar from different shops so um yeah i just think they're really cute and i really like this color palette this is a perfect color palette the really neutral pink gray and white like that is all you need that's all i need <laughs> for as far as icons go so um i didn't talk through all of them because if you watch my plan with me as you know that why i like all of these things i do all these things all the time and then these are the foiled stickers super cute all silver i think i ordered these and these maybe i meant to get those if i didn't order them i can't remember but anyways thank you so much for the extra shiny i really i really like them i'll use all of them for sure so and this foiling is really nice um looks like these are transparent sheets and this is not um but yeah definitely um check down below for my coupon code for planning like a pro Okay, next up is Sweet Bella XO. I'm gonna zoom out for just a second here. Um, I actually, ha Sweet Bella XO in 2020 became one of my favorite uh, like planner shops really quickly. Like I don't even know how it happened. End of 2019 into 2020, she went from someone who I'd heard of and never really ordered before for years to like one of my favorite planner shops in a matter of months. And when she reopened, I got super excited. I placed an order and then I didn't get everything that I wanted and I came back and placed two more orders. So I have three huge orders for Sweet Bella XOXO right now out. So um, this, uh oh, my light is messing with me. This first one, I got um, some kind of additional add-on stickers here and then a kit. I'm gonna go through the kit first. I've said this before, I actually have a plan with me that as of right now I've filmed what I haven't posted yet. Um, that I am going to post but her kit formats are they're so good it's four pages which is like just enough for me to not feel like I don't I like have enough and it's not too little um, but it's so like it's just so well done and the way that she just the stickers within the kit are so good and just even beyond that the way that she like they're just really dainty and pretty like not i've said this before i think when i talk about her kits but like not every checklist bow checklist is equivalent to every other bow checklist hers is just really pretty and dainty and that's true for all of her stickers so this kit is in like totally transparent it's called magical fun and it's not one that i probably would have picked the artwork for from literally any other shop i just it was the only new kit that she had when she opened so i bought it because i love it <laughs> um or i just love her kits and i love having them so it's kind of mix of carnival themed it's gold foil carnival themed florals which i really like and some Disney stuff, which I, carnivals kind of freak me out and I don't really have any intention of going back to Disneyland until I have children again. But um, yeah, I don't even care because I just think this is so cute. <laughs> um, and like all of her stuff, I just really love planning with the kits. So 
I love that she includes these kind of icons. All of her kits have the floral deco. She gives you more than enough quarter boxes, which I really appreciate. Every single page is foiled. You always get that really pretty like floral bottom washi. These are headers and a piece of washi. I mean, yeah, headers and a piece of washi. It's just a perfect kit format. I love it so much. So even though I don't plan on going to any carnivals anytime soon, regardless of the coronavirus situation, <laughs> I just had to have this kit anyways. Okay, and then I also picked up just a bunch of other stickers from her shop. Um, some of these are new to me and some of these I kind of restocked on. Oh, this is the freebie, by the way. Um, but I then, I kind of did something weird here. Like, I'm going to start with these. I obviously have been really into using scallop boxes. I use them from Paint Bird Design pretty much every week. I wanted to expand my collection a little bit. So I picked up these. And then I also picked up these, um, I don't know what to call them. But you, you guys know, I talk all the time about how I love boxes and, like, you know, whatever, not boxes, whatever, just kind of like pieces like this that don't take up the full width of an Erin Condren um, column. So I picked up these and then I, and they're all gorgeous and I love them all very much, but I only picked them up in gold, which is definitely not my style. So you'll see in my next haul, I went back and got them in more colors. Like sometimes I talk myself into like, oh, I'll just get this in one foil color. And I don't really know why that is whenever I pick up the order. <laughs> like whenever I get it, I'm like, why did I only get this in one color? <laughs> Anyways, um, her day dots are some of my favorite. They're just a very like classic kind of font and they're on clear paper. Use those all the time. I've been super into dividers. Again, I just picked up like rose gold in this one and gold in this one. I don't know why I didn't get them all, but I really like them. I really like how dainty they are. So pretty. Um, I picked up uh, these like doily looking kind of things. Um, they are super pretty. I feel like sometimes I get credit for using <laughs> these because I used a bunch of the honey inked uh, snowflakes in my planner this winter so I feel like sometimes people give me credit for using these in the planner community but really this is Rachel of Gathered Play and she I feel like kind of pioneered a lot of this stuff so I have more of these from any honey inks that I'm about to show you super pretty and then I also just wanted to get her date covers because I always really like them in her kits and I just like how simple they are I got them in all the foil colors and I feel like that's really good to pull into spreads this is just a really good pink and like for instance, the I feel like it'll match with this Hello Petite paper spread because she doesn't include date covers and probably even this one too. Yeah, it totally will. So it's just a very good kind of neutral pink. All right, that is everything then from, I should probably grab the kit too, from Sweet Bella XOXO. Okay, lastly for today, again, I don't know if I'm going to include other shops in this after I, I just don't know yet um, but this is from honey inked um, here we go again I just wanted to pick up some more kind of decorative pieces from my spread inspired honestly by a lot of my friends in the planner community so um, this is a freebie that you get with your order not foiled and then this is Rachel of gathered plans her freebie and I think I asked for it in silver because last time I got it in gold just a lot of pretty um mandalas I know a lot of people call them mandalas but my entire life I've always called them mandalas so sorry if I switch back and forth because now I'm hearing mandala so much um these dividers are so pretty oh you know what I am gonna go through and organize this first okay these lace kind of um dividers or headers I think they could go either way are they kiss cut <gasps> they're kiss cut love that oh my goodness anyways these were inspired by Tay of Shante plans she uses them a lot in her spreads and she puts them in the sidebar which I think looks really cute so I wanted to pick up some of these I just think they're like lacy and really pretty and then these flowers um are oh, the foiling is genuinely very good um 
these are kind of inspired a little bit by Tay of Shante plans and Allie of Allie Joan plans. I think I talked about her earlier in this haul that her spreads have been so inspiring to me, her videos. Um, but I just really like the floral deco to like really understated and just the, I don't know. I just think it's really pretty to kind of like add foiling to a half box or something or even a full box. I don't really like full overlays, but I like kiss cut overlays like that. And then, like I mentioned, um, I got a lot of ha half mandalas. This is uh, the first round. So you get um, four sets of three on each of these sheets. And they're just, I don't know, they're just really good to take up space in your planner. Um, I will say her gold, I think I've mentioned this before, is a super, super yellow gold. It's definitely not a true gold or a light gold. It's a really yellow gold, which is not my favorite at all, but... Um, I use gold so much that it just seemed worth it to me to pick all this up in the gold too until she gets a light gold. And then these are, where'd the silver go? I lost the silver. I know I ordered it in silver. Well, I don't know if I lost it or what, probably. Um, <laughs> I'll, I'll find it. These are the half lace mandalas or like almost doily looking ones. Just really pretty too. I just, I like that. And then this sheet is really great. These are the mini versions of the half lace mandala. So let's see, do you get, yeah, you get two sets of each, two sets of five, it looks like. So they match, which I think is cute because I like to use, like when I had the snowflakes and I was using those a lot, I like to use the big ones and the little ones like in the same spread, but using like the same version, like if you're using this one, I use that consistently throughout the spread with this bigger size of it. I think that that kind of makes things look cohesive. And then again, okay, so I lost another sheet. Why am I, I don't know. Well, I'm certain I got this in, <laughs> in silver too, but these are just the regular um, half mandalas. So really pretty. And then I also picked up, I don't know why, again, when I order things, I have a rationale that I can't remember when I later get them in the mail, but I picked up these half lace mandalas, just this singular sheet of this one. Maybe I really liked it or something. I don't know why I picked silver, but, um, or maybe she just sent that. I'm not really sure. I can't remember, but yeah, that is everything from Honey Ink. Just a bunch of kind of clear overlay stickers to just kind of dress up stuff in my planner. So I'm really excited about all that. All right, so that is going to be the end of today's video. I know that I have all of this laid out, um, but I am going to just make a summer uh, planner sticker haul part two that's gonna go up in a few days. So if you liked what you just watched, which, um, uh, yeah, hopefully you did if you stuck around all the way till the end. Definitely subscribe to see more. Um, in, I'll give you kind of a little sneak of what's coming. I have another Sweet Bella XOXO order. I have a paper blush bar order um, from her reopening, which is really exciting. Um, I have a Jackson Pepper order. This is the first time I've ordered from her in a couple years, so that's exciting. I have a M Crystal Prince order. This is the first order ever. I have a very tried and true uh, two little bees order um, with a couple kits there. I have a Harriet Wright Designs order who I now have a, I'm on her summer PR team so I have a co coupon code for her now. It is Lauren15. I have a Hello Petite Paper order. I have a My Newest Addiction order. And then this right here is um, some Aura Estelle inserts that I'm going to be trying now. I've ordered a couple inserts um, and different things to try out to just give my reviews on options besides the Erin Condren planner given everything that happened. So um, that is everything for today. Again, I hope you enjoyed everything that you just saw. And um, if you did, definitely click subscribe to stick around to see all of this coming very soon. Uh, but that's all. Thanks, everybody. Bye.